Hallå, jag är med Tumbo Husvagn och Husbilar i Neskenstuna i Sweden. Och jag vill ta en titt på den här klyff. Det är en 2022-mål. Och på den här 2022-mål är det en ny grill för den Fiat Ducatas modellen. And this is the Mollis 600. They also had some new headlights, also uh, new badges. You can see here that this one has um, 140 horsepower, 9 speed uh, automatic gearbox. They also have fly screen on this one. And the fridge. With a freezer compartment. And down here we have some fuses. And some more storage in there. So this is the uh, Sunlight Cliff 600 automatic gearbox, 140 horsepower, 2022 model. Uh, the base price is 580,000 Swedish crown. This one is sold for 671,000, and that's it's around 70, 67,000 euros. It has some extra uh, 16 inch aluminium wheels, 700. Uh, automatic gearbox is around 4300. And the basic package is 2300. Uh, and the total weight is 3500 kilos, and the weight of the vehicle is 2883. So you have a payload of 617 kilos. It's 599 centimeter length, 200. Firing with a three berth, you can have three passengers. Yeah. So on this uh, 2022 model, you also have a, a new dashboard and a new gear knob here, and also a little smaller steering wheel uh, with buttons on here. Also new instruments. But you can see here there are no blinds. On the front window, not side or here on the side window. You also have a, a new engine on this uh, 2022 model. It's a 2.2 liter engine. It's uh, a little bit more efficient than the 2.3 liter. But here you can see you have both fly screen on blinds on the side windows. Here you also have some light with the, with the rail here, so you can move the lights if you like, like this. And above here we have a cabinet with a ledge. Also here we have uh, some storage all the way, left to right. And we have a skylight also here. And if you like, you can like that. You can extend the table so it will be easier access for the person sitting in that uh, chair. So here in the kitchen we also have some cabinets. So the same with a little ledge here. Also have some hooks here. And some storage in here. And there's a two burner hub with maximum pots of 160 and 220. And here we have the sink.
down here is a cabinet with some shelves, also with some little ledge here. And here we have two main sockets and a drawer, maybe for your cutlery here. It's soft closing now. And here's another cabinet. Here's the garage. As you can see here, you have a window on this side, also with blinds and a fly screen. And here on the left side. You also have some lights, also with this type of rail. And this side uh, is a little bit broader than the other side, so you have your head here, so you sleep uh, widthwise this direction. Also have some cabinets here. And also a skylight here. So here in the bathroom we have a duck bar. We also have a curtain here, so you can see the rail in the ceiling. We also have a rail here for your wet clothes or towels. Some cabinets here, also with ledges. And some quite deep ledges here. So have a mirror here. I'm 178 centimeters tall or 510 and it's maybe seven or eight more centimeters to the ceiling here. And you also have a window here so if you like you can shower on the outside if you don't want this area to get. Also blinds and fly screen here. Here was, we also have a USB socket here. And here we have a, yes, there's a rail, so you can use this as a wardrobe. And here you have the uh, main control and the control for the thermal heating system. Also here on the back door, you have both blinds, fly screen. You also have some storage up here. That's the gas cabinet. You can have two canisters in here. And behind here you have the toilet cassette. And here's the main hookup. Behind here is the diesel. So if you like this video please give it a thumbs up, subscribe and uh, if you like and watch uh, some of my other videos you can subscribe and watch my latest here and you have, here you have some uh, playlists for um, uh, camp vans from 2022 and 2021 so binge watch them if you like so thanks for this time bye bye